Today, I'm going to talk about impossible storylines, people. Impossible storylines. At the beginning of the year, this is where my channel launched from. It was John Means and Garrett Cole, who had a 1.37 and a 1.61 ERA at the time. Not the case anymore, okay? And this was their first 11, 12 starts. This is the first third of the season. John Means threw a no-hitter while cheating. Like, I, that was the biggest video I ever made. It had 3 million views, exposing John Means for throwing a no-hitter while cheating and using foreign substance. And I caught him every single week. Every week, he was going into the glove, cheating, cheating, cheating. This had been an epidemic that had spread all over baseball. Uh, John Boy came onto my page. He said 100% of pitchers used it. I figured out it was more like 60%, which it actually was. Uh, I was happy to be talking with John Boy in the beginning of things. and He seemed happy. Um, he didn't think that it was right, but he loved the idea that the league might step in, right? He said he would love that the league would potentially step in. Well, guess what they did? They stepped in. Enforcement happened mid-June, and the game drastically changed. It drastically changed, and here's John Means, the no-hit master, up against the Jays, who blew up Garrett Cole back-to-back -back times in the last two times they faced him. It's such a change from the beginning of the season. These master pitchers who seemed unhittable, and I seemed so stupid for saying that they would fall off incredibly once the foreign substance wasn't being loaded up pitch after pitch after pitch. And that's the case. Uh, Garrett Cole's ERA is ballooned to 323, will not win the Cy Young this year. And John Means, honestly, he looked like a batting practice pitcher, just throwing meatballs right over the heart of the plate. Guerrero hit his 47th, uh, tying Eddie Matthews for most ever. And let's look at Teo Hernandez. Teoscar Hernandez has an 1124 OPS against lefties. And when you throw balls that are just not breaking, they're just hanging out over the middle of the plate, Teoscar's going to smash him too. They blew him up for seven runs. So, you know, Teo doesn't just love lefties. He loves everything right now. And this shot right here sums it all up. Like John means from the beginning of the year to karma kicking in at the end of the year. And for those who've been watching from the beginning of the year, it has been a roller coaster.